What's up guys, David here. Um first time doing my first YouTube video. Um Famer Dave as you may know me. I'm doing um a video on how to build basically an iPhone app. Um as you can see here's my iPhone app called Recipes 101. Um and this is in phone gap. So it basically uses HTML. So if you're familiar with HTML, this tutorial is definitely for you. Um, basically what you do is you just go to your root file of your www, which in my case is in finder, documents, recipes 101, and www. Um, for this tutorial I went ahead and created a recipe called lemon pie, um, which is a dessert. Basically what I would do is I would copy um, a food that I've already created, which I just got from the iWeb Kit, which is a cool framework for developing mobile apps like this, with, along with PhoneGap. You can and just like rename it Pecan Pie, and then you'll just go get the recipe and you'll type the recipe right in there. For this example, I'm gonna go ahead and delete Pecan Pie and go check out Lemon Pie. Lemon pie. It's right in here. Um, basically, I just will scroll down. I'll make sure that it's going back to dessert, and I'll type what it means, and I'll change the header to lemon pie. Now, what do I need to do in dessert? Well, since I'm doing a pecan pie, I need to change this to the spaghetti thing to pecan pie, and then whatever we saved it, whatever the HTML file was, we could put pecan pie. Understand? So basically, you're just linking to it. So I'm not going to create a whole new thing because it takes so long to type. But I just want to show you this so you would understand how you would actually create a new, like, how you would go about creating a new recipe. For this tutorial, um, I just created a lemon pie, which is a really good recipe, actually. So check it out just right here's the recipe if you want to like pause the video and watch it but I'm gonna build and run the application now and here's the iPhone simulator that comes nice with the iOS CK um, as you can see here's the app when you boot it normally as long as it's not multitasking I'm gonna go ahead and clear it out of multitasking while opening up that app and go back to it um, normally, it would have a boot logo. Mine says phone gap because I haven't changed it yet. Let's go to dessert. Let's go to lemon pie. And as you can tell, here's the lemon pie recipe, which you can copy and paste and print. We hope to be adding printing to this app soon. So you'll just be able to print. This will be an app in the app store, hopefully soon. And when you click the back button, it takes you back to the desserts. Pecan pie is not actually linked into a page, so it just stays blue. Neither is spaghetti tacos. That's... Oh, and here's another thing. We're in the dessert, but it says meat. That's because I just copied it off the meat page. So let's go back to dessert here and just change this to dessert. This all comes nice bundled right into the program I web kit or to the um, if you want to call it a framework, JavaScript framework. So um I don't know how long this video is, but I hope you will rate, comment, and subscribe on this video. It is my first video. I hope to get them better. Now it says dessert. As you can tell, the videos will get better. They'll have like how to actually start your first iPhone app. I just wanted to do this video. It is kind of late. So I'm going to talk to you guys later. And thanks for watching.